Hello and welcome to Leuco Reduction Irradiation and Washing. My name is Mallory Bryant and I'm a current fourth year medical student. We have the following take home points. Leuco Reduction reduces CMV transmission and HLA allo immunization. Irradiation prevents transfusion associated graft versus host disease. Wash red blood cells in patients with allergic transfusion reactions. Leukoreduction is a technique that reduces the number of leukocytes present in the transfused erythrocyte or platelet products. More than 80% of blood banks perform universal leukoreduction, but for those who don't, it should be performed in high-risk individuals. Leukoreduction reduces class 1 HLA alloantibody production, subsequent platelet transfusion refractoriness, febrile non-hemolytic transfusion reactions, and transmission of CMV. It cannot be relied on to prevent transfusion-associated graft-versus-host disease. Irradiation is a process that uses radiation to destroy donor lymphocytes in erythrocyte and platelet transfusion products. It is used to prevent transfusion-associated graft-versus-host disease, which is mediated by donor lymphocytes. It is indicated in patients with severe inherited T-cell immunodeficiency syndromes of Hodgkin lymphoma or those who have undergone stem cell transplant. It is also indicated in those who are on certain chemotherapies or immunocompetent patients receiving HLA-matched platelets or transfusions from relatives. It is worth noting that irradiation can weaken the erythrocyte membrane, causing reduced cell viability and potassium leakage. Washing is a process that removes the proteins residing in the small amount of plasma of erythrocyte and platelet transfusions and is used in patients with a history of severe recurrent allergic reactions, IgA deficiency, or complement-dependent autoimmune hemolytic anemia. Also, it reduces the amount of potassium transfused for use in patients who are at risk for hyperkalemia. In summary, Leukoreduction reduces CMV transmission and HLA allo immunization. Irradiation prevents transfusion associated graft versus host disease. And remember to wash red blood cells in patients with allergic transfusion reactions. This ends our video on leukoreduction, irradiation, and washing. Thank you for watching.